Hi and welcome to Pavli Email Marketing. I am Rishi Madhwani and in this video we will be connecting Amazon SES with Pavli Email Marketing. So let's get started. As you might be aware that you can connect multiple SMTP servers in Pavli Email Marketing. One of them is Amazon SES. To connect your Amazon SES server with Pabli Email Marketing, you need to first enter the email address through which you want to send email. Click on Add Email Address. As you can see, a template link has been generated. You can copy the link from here using the Copy Template button. Then you need to connect to Amazon SES via this template link. So first you have to log in to Amazon AWS account that is Amazon Web Services account. So as you can see, I have already logged into my account. In the search for service bar, search for CloudFormation. CloudFormation is here. Click on CloudFormation. As soon as you click on CloudFormation, this window will appear. You need to create a stack in order to connect Amazon SES with Pabli email marketing. So click on to create stack on the right hand side. It will ask for template prerequisite. As our template is ready, we need to click on to, we need to select on to template is ready and we have to paste this URL which we have copied earlier in the Amazon S3 URL option. Click on to next. You have to name your stack and it should be something unique. So I am naming it as click on to next. In the configure stack option, you don't have to do anything. Just scroll to the end of the page and click on next. You have to review your stack. As you can see, this was our template link which we have entered. This is my email address which I have entered. So everything seems to be pretty correct. I need to acknowledge. Click on create stack option. As soon as you click on create option, you will land to this window where you can see the create is in process. Now it takes a few minutes to create a stack. It is recommended to refresh it once or twice until uh, the process is complete you can see the full process history here so now we're just going to wait for two to three minutes to so as soon as the process is complete your name will be shown in the logical id and status will be shown as complete okay so i'll click on to refresh so it approximately took 311 to almost 315 so it four minutes to complete the process and as I said earlier the status will be the stack will be created when the in the logical ID the stack name is there and the status is completed there is one last step to follow you need to go to your Gmail account and click on and click on to the verification link as soon as you have clicked on to the verification link you will receive a congratulation text now I'll move on to our Amazon SES account so now if my Amazon SES is connected it will show a green signal over here which will mean that my account is active and I can send emails from it so I'm clicking on to refresh as you can see it's a green signal here Amazon SES is now my active server and I can enjoy sending emails via Amazon SES but there's one more process that you need to follow in order to send bulk emails to from Amazon SES initially Amazon SES puts you in the sandbox mode and you will have to follow this documentation to move out of the sandbox mode so I'll click on to the documentation here is the process via which you can move out of the sandbox mode and enjoy sending bulk emails we will be co covering this topic as well in an another video i hope the connection process is clear and if you have any doubts related to any feature of pabli email marketing you can contact us on the live chat support you just have to enter your name enter your email address and type your message and you can send it to us our team will be happy to assist you thank you so much for watching